with daily life grinding to a halt and uh, income following suit, lawmakers in Washington say they want to make sure that Americans have a cushion during this crisis. Washington correspondent Morgan Wright says that Senate Republicans are saying the Senate will not leave the Capitol until they have put together the next federal package of aid. We need to go big uh, to win the war against uh, this virus. Maryland Senator Chris Van Hollen says the next federal financial aid package must be targeted and deployed right away. A trillion dollars um, at least, it may need to be more than that. We are in an unprecedented crisis. It will take historic commitment in the trillions of dollars. Connecticut Senator Richard Blumenthal says whatever the amount is, it must support the backbone of the nation. It has to put cash into the pockets of small businesses and individual families and workers. The administration is proposing a trillion dollar economic relief package to provide individual payouts to Americans, protect the airline industry, and support small businesses. Pennsylvania Senator Patrick Toomey says the legislation needs to help prevent unemployment. We got to make sure there are jobs to go back to. But Connecticut Senator Chris Murphy cautions the administration must focus more attention on the health crisis. No matter how big a stimulus check you get to people, if you don't get serious about the health care crisis, which this administration still isn't serious about, then you are not going to address the root problem. Murphy says we need more tests and support for hospitals. Right now, no economic help will work if we don't stop the virus. And Senate leaders say the latest relief package won't be the last coronavirus legislation they pursue. Reporting in Washington, I'm Morgan Wright.